I am Lord Otranto of Antiva, rightfully betrothed of Lady Josephine Montillier. Songs of your exploits have spread to my city, Inquisitor. It's humbling to make your acquaintance. It is a pity it will not last longer. Before we duel, I trust you find the weapon to your satisfaction. Am I not allowed to pick my means of defense? I am the wounded party in this duel. Tradition dictates that I select our weapons. Of course, if you fear you might be clumsy with such a refined instrument, there is no shame in a forfeit. I trust you've made this a fair fight, Lord Otranto. Upon my honor. Shall we begin? An admirable start, Inquisitor. And I was worried a civilized weapon might puzzle you, Lord Kadash. I'm glad Lady Montillier isn't here, exquisite as I've heard her appearance to be. Cutting you down in front of Josephine would have given a poor first impression of House Otranto to my bride. Josephine doesn't want this engagement. Call it off. To what purpose? You can't think I'd... Stop! Josephine! Lady Montillier, what a pleasure to... What are you doing? Josephine, I can't take the chance that you might have to marry him. That's not your decision. The Inquisition needs you. I need you. Yet you threw yourself into danger. Why do this? Why risk everything we've built? Why risk your life? Because I love you. You... You do? He does? Yes, Josephine. I love you so much. I love you too. Well fought. Lord Otranto. I'd assumed your liaison with the Inquisitor was an affair of passion or a convenience, Lady Montillier. But I'm not fool enough to stand in the way of true affection. The Otrantos regretfully withdraw the terms of our betrothal. Thank you. Do not thank me. I know when I'm outmatched. Josephine, I've never been happier in my life. We're tempting fate with such talk, but neither have I. Just do kiss me again. <laughs>